Welcome to Coastlands Corner. My name is Pam Brady. Today, I'm going to share with you one of my favorite object lessons. An object lesson is a physical representation of a spiritual reality. As we travel to different Christian education venues, I very often meet young people who are bored in the Lord. And it looks like this. Whoa, we're still in chapel. What I want to bring is a representation of the real Psalm 122.1. I was glad when they said unto me, let us go to the house of the Lord. Chapel should be fun. Sometimes students will say to me, Dr. Brady, I'm not ready to get serious about the God thing. I gotta clean up my life first. Well, let's take a look at this. We have a cup which is filled with sin. Sadly, that's you and I. The book of Romans tells us that all have sinned and fall short of the glory of God. So, we have our sin and our need for God. What I love about this is John 3.30. It says, he must increase, I must decrease. See, the order is important there because we're not able to get rid of our own sin. As the word of God fills us, our sin begins to fall away. In physics, this is called displacement. As God, by his grace, fills us, it washes away our sin. My sin, though it be as scarlet, will be made white as snow. This is him increasing. As he increases in my life, I decrease. My sin goes away. And ultimately, hmm, not even a hint, not even a hint of sin. This reminds me of today's mentor challenge verse from 1 John 4.4. 4. Greater is he who is in me than he who is in the world. Have a great day.